Hey Habran, this is Mukesh Otwani once again from LearnHibernation.com. You must have seen a lot of issues were available in Selenium two months back when there was a new update by Chrome and the scripts was failing, right? So again, there was a fix by Selenium and it got fixed. Now we have a new release by Selenium which is 4.9.0 and they did a couple of changes. So in case if you are still using the older version, you can update to the latest version which is 5.9.0. So let me show you what changes they did and how you can update your existing project to 4.9.0. So if you come to Selenium official website, which is selenium.dev downloads. So you will see the latest stable version, which is 4.9.0. So if you click on it, it will download this jar file. So basically this jar file is only needed when you're using a non Maven project or Gradle project. But in real time, we use Maven or Gradle projects. So in that case, you will be updating the dependencies. So I will show you that as well. But before that, let me show you. So if you come back to this point, uh, so again, this release is available for all the programming languages for C Sharp, for Ruby, for all the languages they have released 4.900. Now, if you want to see what changes happened in the latest version, so if you click on uh, 4.9.0, it will show you that what changes happened in 4.9.0. And that was like, this is the issue which I was talking about. So there was a major issues which coming right with the Chrome one. So they fixed with 4.8.2 after that 4.8.3 and now we have 4.9.0. So they have added supported CDP versions for 85, 110, 111, 112, which is the latest version at this moment. Handle redirect inside the JDK HTTP client. Now this is something which we will talk about some other time that how selenium is changing from json via protocol to bi-directional okay which is by the protocol selenium manager use binary from the browser options okay and this is changes related to grid allowing binary to set via options when not set in the grid some log exception messages so you can see these all are some are bugs some are uh, pull requests which they have fixed and the one again fixing remote execution for edge browser when Java 8 client is used. So this was uh, a new announcement. So many people were facing remote execution specific for Edge browser. So this is also fixed now. How you can update it? So this is my project. I'm using Maven project, but if you're using Gradle also, you will be updating your build.xml file. Okay, so this is uh, the pwn.xml file. Right now, at the time of recording this, I'm using 4.8.3 and if you see my dependencies all these dependencies are set for 4.8.3 right this one all these dependencies so if i change this to 4.9.0 just type 4.9.0 so you will be getting proposals so if you directly use you can get the proposal directly or you can copy paste the moment i save this you can see it started building and now it's downloading the latest version all the dependencies will get updated so it's building 62 percent and you will see it got updated here you will not see any major changes in the normal execution but the moment you start using with the latest versions when you're using grid you will see a big differences okay if you're facing some issues with grid remote execution with different browsers so that's a very quick video i thought i will quickly update all of you but in case if you are working with previous version and everything is going good no need to update but uh, if you are using CDP protocol extensively, then 112 support is available with 4.9.0. Yeah, that's all about this video. So if you like this video, share with your friends, colleagues, those who are using Selenium. If you need any additional topic related to Selenium or any other topic, please let me know in the comment section and I will try to record a video for the same. Thank you so much, guys. Have a nice day. Bye-bye.